in the city of Dhanbad, also known as the coal capital of India. The institute initially offered courses in mining engineering, applied geology, supported by the Department of Applied Science, which includes applied physics, applied chemistry, and applied mathematics. Institute expanded by introducing courses in petroleum engineering, and applied geophysics. Eventually, flowering of the institute in its real sense took place with the inception of more and more branches such as mining machinery engineering. Mineral Engineering and Industrial Engineering and Management Electronics Engineering Computer Science and Engineering Mechanical Engineering Electrical Engineering Environmental Engineering Chemical Engineering Civil Engineering and Engineering Physics has 18 academic departments covering engineering, applied science, humanities and social sciences and management programs. ISM is one of the leading institutes of the country that is engaged in a number of research and development programs. The selection process for the various programs at ISM takes place through IIT JEE, GATE, NET and CAT, which are considered to be the country's toughest examinations. The academic standards at ISM is equally challenging for the students. Also known as the Heritage Building, houses the departments of Mining Engineering and Applied Geology. And to add on, the center of attraction of the heritage building lies in its geological museum. Being a fully residential, peaceful and safe campus.
ISM has a number of hostels for boys and girls. Diamond Hostel Opal Hostel Emerald Hostel Ruby Hostel Topaz Hostel Sapphire Hostel Amber Hostel Jasper Hostel Rosaline Hostel and Hostel for International Students. Some hostels date back to 1926 like the Diamond Hostel. The hostels are equipped with internet connections, mess and canteen facilities. The specialty of the institute lies in its laboratories such as the Seismic Observatory, Data Processing Laboratory, the Long Wall Mine Gallery and the Remote Sensing Laboratory. It is also equipped with groundwater harvesting facilities. The Penman Auditorium, named after Dr. Penman, the first principal of the school, is the center for organizing various academic and co-curricular activities. While the Golden Jubilee Lecture Theater is earmarked for workshops, presentations and seminars. Most of the classes of the students are held at the new lecture hall complex. The new International Executive Development Center, EDC Annex, is meant for international students. The computer center supports campus-wide fiber optic network. It caters to the computing needs of the faculty members and the students. The four-storied health center at the campus has the latest facilities to provide medical care to students, teachers, staff, and their family members. The automated library of ISM caters to the need of the users of the 18 departments and other centers. The library houses 85,000 books, 8,000 PhD theses and dissertations, 35,000 bound volumes of journals and 1,200 digital books. It provides access to 2,000 full-text scholarly research journals. A new 8-story central library designed to be one of the best libraries in Asia and the biggest in any Indian university is about to be functional. The institute has a vibrant campus life. The day brings in multiple academic challenges for the students, while the evening offers them moments of joy and recreation by allowing them to engage in sportive and recreational activities. There are various clubs to enhance the students' specific hobbies like dramatics, dance, music, entrepreneurship, robotics, mechatron, etc. Among the various students' social bodies, Kartavya and Fast Forward India aim at educating poverty-stricken and slum-dwelling children to help deprived students shape their future. FFI organizes blood donation camps. ISM organizes a plethora of extracurricular activities that enhance the spirit of participation and healthy competition among the students.